Well, hey, hey, hey. ESO, peeps. This is Aturga, and I'm back on Kenarthi's Roost. We're going to try to do a little side quest before we board that ship. So, I have a side quest chosen, something about a tree. In the meantime, I guess we'll like see if we could find this quest. Oh boy. Are you really messing with my familiar? Uh, that was totally unprovoked. Um, I don't know if that's what we're going to encounter this whole time. I don't know. Um, I think I need to go up this way. i got to follow that blue icon up on the top. And I'm also looking for something about a tree. And I think it's that tree right there. Look at that poor tree. Yeah, something going on with that tree. Let me take a look at it. Look at this poor tree. Look at this poor tree. All the leaves are all brown. All the other trees around are all green. Look at that big one back there. And this poor tree? That looks terrible. Uh, so, I don't know if this I is a I hear your pain, old one. I'm person. doing what I can. Oh, are we supposed to be talking to you? Windcatcher plantation depends on the great tree, yet it sickens before my eyes. Our fates are like leaves in its branches. Well, look at your outfit. You look like part of that tree. No leaves. Okay, so what's wrong with the great tree? Do you see that strange miasma? It appeared on the great tree after the hurricane, like a sickness. I've done what I can, but I fear it's not enough. Really? Is there anything I can do? There's a cave directly beneath us. I called a spirit there to heal the great tree's roots, but it hasn't returned. Would you see what holds the spirit back and aid it if you can? Okay, sounds fair enough. I can feel the spirit's frustration. It wants to help the great tree, but something prevents it. Well, how can I help the spirit? The spirit is old and powerful. It seeks to move from root to root, aiding the great tree as it's able. But it's a healing spirit of singular purpose. It doesn't know how to defend itself. Oh, wow. Is the spirit in danger? If so, the spirit must be protected from harm while it heals the great tree's roots. It knows what it must do. And why is this tree so important? The great tree shields Windcatcher Plantation from the winter winds and keeps our settlement shaded from the heat of the summer. Its story entwines with ours. Really now? But what about any other tree? When the wind goddess Kanarthi first traveled across the heavens, legends say she grew tired and rested in the branches of a small sapling before resuming her journey. That sapling became the great tree and gave Windcatcher Plantation its name. Well, ain't that a hoot. The spirit is old and powerful. It seeks to move from root to root, aiding the great tree as it's able. But it's a heat. Okay, so down underneath here is a cave. All right, we're going to have to go down. But why is that Why is that thing right there discolored? Iron ore. All right, we're going. I know, familiar. You like? Let's get going. Okay, let's go. Let's see if we can get down below. I don't know who these people are that attacked me a minute ago.
What familiar coming? Yep, there you are. That's a player. You see that? That's a player. Just hanging out. <laughs> well, isn't this something? Okay. Am I gonna have to fight you? Are you messing with my familiar? Oh, really? Don't even think about it. Alright. You started it. Now, let's see if we could find the cave. Well, it's not very hard to find. Here we go. Uh, first of all, I think I need to switch this cycle. So, this quest, enter the cave. Alright, we're in this quest, the root of the problem. Here we go. What's this poor person doing? Been a Quama master for over a decade. I'm not afraid to admit when I'm up to my neck in droppings, and I sure could use a hand getting out. What's the problem? Ever try piloting a ship through a hurricane while your entire cargo of Quama eggs hatch and go bug nuts? Been there. Can't recommend it. After we wrecked, they made a Quama line toward this cave. I came after them, but they're a bit distracted. Distracted? What do you mean? They always get surly after hatching, but these Kwama are downright unsociable. I tried to stop them from chewing on those huge roots. Oh, boy. Ejected. Bumped into a fine-looking tree trunk on my way out. Thought I was done for, but it kept walking. That must be the spirit. No. Oh, Kwama didn't take to it, whatever it was. I heard them munching on it, same as those roots. Mm, the little ones seem scared of it. If you can help the pretty tree trunk do what it needs to do, I bet they'll head back this way. And the big ones? If they'd stop eating those giant roots, they might get better. But I don't blame you if you have to put down a few to save the rest. Just be careful. Nothing fiercer than a crazed Kwama. Not even my sister-in-law. <laughs> Aren't you something? Okay. Go back to your slumber. We're going down here. Uh-huh. What is that up there? Is that the spirit? Oh boy, here we go. That's what we need to do. We need to beat these guys up. Don't let them beat us. And that guy that's up on the top slumbering, he could have helped. Right? Um, all right, I don't want another pair of gloves, but I do want to help the spirit. Okay, spirit. Um, is that something that we need to do with you? Get out of here. This is the tree spirit. Isn't that the coolest thing? Alright, let's get this guy out. And you too. Okay. Here's some more. Mess with my familiar now. What? I'm done. 
storm calling increased. Okay, let's go. One more. There they are. you another player is this the way back out I think it is what's with you oh that's a worker uh-huh back out I think we have to go back up the hill. Wait a minute, are you the person? Yeah. Here we go. Praise Ifre. The miasma has cleared. Yet I sense this begins a new chapter for the great tree. Good. Though the creatures gorge themselves upon its roots, this was a passing instinct. They can be taught to strengthen the great tree. Are you sure they won't harm the tree? The Kwama will soon learn the cave is their nest and treat the spirit as their queen. Together, they'll guard the cave against intruders who seek to harm the great tree. A new story can frighten any creature until it realizes its role within. Okay. It looks like I get a new um, quest item. All right. I completed that side quest. Well, cool, folks. So I think what we'll do now is we'll probably like uh, get on our horse and go wander the countryside. There we go. Bam. Let's go wander. I want to go that way. How about I follow him? <laughs> follow another player. See what they're up to. Ah. Oh, this guy wants to collect. Okay. Collect you go. Uh, I want to see what's going on here. Not much. That's a trader. Okay. Now it says I should board the skiff, but I don't want to do that right yet. Um, I don't think there's any other quest, active quest. So we're going to just kind of wander around a little bit. Maybe jump off and fight some of these critters. That's where I am. Um, that's a house we could buy. Temple of the Two Moons, we did that one. Uh, I think we're going to head in the opposite direction of where I'm pointed. So, we're going to turn this horse around and go that away somehow. Let's go see what's up in them thar hills.
Well, I think we should probably get off and fight some things. It'll give us some points. So, we're going to do that. Uh huh. All right. What could we beat up? Let's go after this guy. How come you're not? Oh, now you're working. Yeah, now you're working. Bam. I don't really care about collecting, but maybe I should. Let's see what he's got. Rawhide scraps. We'll do that because we'll sell it. Um, two of them at once? What do you think? Let's do it. You get them from the rear, familiar. I'll get them from up here. One down. Good working teamwork. Teamwork. Rawhide scraps. Thank you very much. We'll try to get our level up a little bit before we sign off. Uh, how about some crabs? Yeah, I'll do some crabs. Let's guys are fast. Look at them come. Whoa. Alright, what have you got? I bet you've got oh, chitin. And some rawhide. And some of that. I'm going to take this stuff and sell it. Clean pelt? I don't know if I want a clean pelt. Thank you very much. Ah, here's one. I'm gonna clean up the beach. Aha! Another clean pelt. I gotta watch my um, inventory because you only got so many slots, right? And and if you Use up your slots. Let's see. What's my inventory? See that? 49 out of 60. Okay. So. I'm going to try to keep going with the rawhide. Are you alive or dead? You're dead. Uh, we're going to mosey along. There's one. Whoa. Thunderbug. Oh, he does lightning. Whoa. Okay. What are you going to give me? Beetle scuttle. I don't want that. Um, I don't want it. If I don't want it, I don't want it. Let's go after this one. He gives me rawhide. Look at that jump. Oh, you tried to bite me, did you? Rawhide stra strips. Alright, so that's way west. We're gonna head towards the east. I'll see if we have to go around here, or what do we have to do? Ah. Oh, those guys are fierce. I don't know if it gives me any special points for doing it. They they saw me. Uh, they're coming. I'm thinking about it. Place is crawling with them. I don't have anything on my agenda. I'm just out here 
looking for stuff to get some points. And check this place out. Um What are you all about? Bazera? You are very lucky to survive this storm. Kenarthi smiles upon us. Or perhaps we are just lucky. Okay. By way, Bezera is grateful. Okay. Good to meet you. I don't want to get my dress all messed up in that mud. Wait a minute. That's a pretty house, isn't it? Wow. That is a pretty house. Wow, check it out. That's a beautiful little house. Whoa. Yeah, what's the, what's the deal with this house? You know you are not supposed to be here. Oh, it's not my house, so I guess I'm not supposed to be here. <laughs> okay, and look at the kitty. Oh, how cute. That's a little Siamese cat. Whoa. Okay, well, I better not pick on things that don't belong to me. What about you? What's the world? Nasty business, these rats. It is a good thing we have so many cats about. Little oh. pests never stood a chance. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, so how are we going to get over there? I think somehow... I don't know if there's a bridge. Do we just have to try to make a swim of it? Let's go up here. All right, let's get you. I'm going to get you from this side. Let you go down the hill. Whoa. There you go. Bam. Go down. Uh-huh. All right. I wanted to go around this. Let's see if I can get to that little bridge. Oh, here's another one. Might as well do him. Give me a hide. Thank you very much. Oh, well, there's one of those. Where's that bridge? Ouch. Ouch. Oh, he didn't even give me anything. What are these pretty blue flowers? I think I'll have that. <laughs> All right, sometimes I have to have what I have to have. I guess that's for, en not enchanting, but alchemy. Might have to stop at an alchemy station and see if I could make something. Let's take the butterfly. Only if we could use it for... something. Alright, here's another one of you guys. Let's do it. Maple bow. I'm going to sell it. I am going to sell it. That was a good one to have. Okay, so that's north. And we don't really want to go there yet. I want to keep going sort of east. Let's see what I can find. Oh. 
Did you really think you were gonna chase after me? Leave my familiar alone. I don't think I have as much power with that heavy hit as I do with just a lot of little hits. Okay, we're just gonna wander the countryside. Yeah, what's the plan? It's kind of... I hear something. Thought I heard something. Oh, maybe I heard the sheep. That could be. Oh. I'm just kind of wandering because, you know, there's little, like, things that you can find if you're wandering. What about on here? Nope. Oh. All right, we're heading east. What's this strange looking thing? A cat. All right. Oh, here we go. This guy looks more powerful than the normal. He might have more of a treasure in him. All right, what have you got? Rawhide. Well, it's all good because I'm gonna sell it. Keep on keeping on. East we go. Whoop. There's a rune. Okay, so which ones do we have? Donata and Denny. I'm gonna take all. Yeah. I haven't done anything with them yet, but I will. Oh, here's another one to use. Hello. All right. Rawhide. What's here? Barrows? What's in here? Uh oh. Go up the ramp. Hush, okay. Father. I won't leave your side. I think I talked to you before, didn't I? Father burns in the fire. My brother missing. Srendar show mercy. I've already done this. Home sugar storehouses caught fire. Father thought to save our livelihood. He ran inside, and the burns weren't bad. Is there anything I can do? But I Father I've... tried to save our alchemical tools. If they survived the fire, I could trade them for medicine. Please, it's all I can do to keep my father alive. Okay. So begs you to salvage the tools from our storehouses. Hmm. Look at her. <laughs> Uh, what the hey? Return quickly with the tools. If I can't trade them for medicine, this one's father will die. What? Oh, moon sugar, yes? Oh no. Moon sugar cane grows well on these isles. With my people's sweet tooth, there can never be enough to sprinkle on our meals. Yeah, there's more to it than just moon sugar. Kind of like moonshine. Yeah. Okay, so. 
Your brother's missing? Yes. Savan Ma shares a temper with hurricanes. After a great quarrel with this one, he stormed off and left us short clawed. Hmm. Father had to cancel his trip to Mistral, and now he's. He's not dead. Okay, so we've got this other little side quest that I guess we'll do next time we're on. Salvage the alchemy tools. Alright. Well, peeps, it looks like this is our next quest for our next day. And right now, we're just going to say bye for now. With a short, sweet... Don't you just love the music? I do. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye for now.